Here we have got uh, sales data uh, with customer name in column A and total sales amount in column B. And over in column C, basically we need to create uh, the group based on the group by uh, range that is provided in C2. So in case if you are going to do it manually, it would be uh, time taking basically and that would not be dy dynamic. It means every time user will uh, change the group by value, we'll have to come back and make this adjustment. Okay. So to make it dynamic, we can utilize the floor function. So let's start with that. So first floor function and the first function, the first part of the function we will use to create the lower bound of uh, bin basically. So let's put this number as a reference that is B5 significance that would be C2. A close bracket then ampersand and then hyphen here and ampersand okay and the next function next part of this function would be uh, to calculate the upper bound of uh, this bin so again this number would be uh, this one comma significance that would be this again plus then this one c2 now we are done